beauty. We don't need, you know, we've got too many guys with chips on their shoulder. Shoo! You know, we've got too many guys who think that they are only on the hook. Because you know why? Because this is the worst form. This is the worst form of haughtiness. This is the worst form of pride. That when you give your pride a religious paradigm, a religious justification, so you think you can speak condescendingly to other people. You think that you have a God-given right to look down on other people because you're on the hook and they're on the back. If you really are concerned, then work on the brother or the sister. Be nice. Be nice to the person. And this is why, you know, especially at this age, uh, you know, at the university age, we have too many people of that disposition who cause, you know, disunity. Nobody in 1400 years, look, Ahl Sunnah have certain parameters. Yeah, the parameters have been written by the ulama. But nobody in 1400 years has the entire ummah agreed on one way. Never. Never even tried the Sahaba. So why are you shoving your opinion down other people's throats and causing disunity and discord in the Muslim Ummah? And this is something you know we need to understand because often we are the greatest cause of disunity. People have different approaches to us as long as they're within the confines of the Ahl Sunnah wal Jama'ah, that's fine. But we should not make us people, you know, who look at people in a condescending way or, or look down on people. We need a bit of unity here. The Muslim Ummah needs unity. And if you don't realize it now, then Allah, I don't know when you're going to realize it. I don't know when you're going to realize it.